Hi, it's George from Skahoy and here I have an E201 controller. Right now it's connected only to this uh, E2ME production studio 4K switcher. So let's see how it works. Uh, basically the two uh, button rows are uh, preview and program bus. Here we have some controls, uh, cuts also of A2 Black and so on, a T bar. And here in the menu you can see that we have a picture in picture and we can set uh, where we want it to be. You see that the hyper it says hyperdeck not connected because there is no hyperdeck in the network. But if you connect it you can record and uh, stop your recording with this button. Right now it just doesn't work. There is a smart view thing here, but I don't have a smart view here. So I cannot control it really and uh, you see video hub is not connected because it's not on the network um, smart scope again i cannot control it because it's not on the network but then i have auto rate here so i can change my auto transition uh, rate i have fade to black rate i can also change that and then we go to the first uh, menu then in this, this button we have the one me uh, if I press it, I can control the auxiliary bus and uh, with those uh, buttons here I have a media player again with these buttons um, Then I have audio solo again here And uh, I have macros, I can play macros here This bus is always a preview program now um, then uh, we have uh, ATEM2ME preview program and then uh, we have auxiliary 2 and 3 and then um, audio route for those two channels audio 1 and uh, channel 1 and channel 2 we can select which channels we want to use and we can select also the analog inputs and here we have video hub which is not connected so we don't have this menu we don't have the next one again because it's again uh, video hub related and then we have the presets for um, um, chroma keying which we can store and uh, recall now if you don't want to have those menus that are empty on this button uh, for example if we go here where we had this um, video hub we can just press and hold until it becomes red and then it's deleted and again with this one too so now I don't have them in this menu anymore so I have a shorter menu and if I want to restore it I just go to here press the reset until it's green and now I have them again but since I don't have a um, video hub connected to the unit it's just not here. Everything else works as it is described on our YouTube video. The, those uh, knobs uh, control the audio channels, the main channel, and uh, this is for the ATEM switcher.